could this be? Nami. Nami, sports game. AFA, football. Adidas, oh, definitely, definitely football. All right, welcome back, everyone, uh, to Let's Play some sports games. And here we have uh, another football game, and I'm sure you know why it is, uh, given that you know, Konami developed it. Exciting music, perfect for football. Everybody having fun. That's probably saying that if you play multiplayer with your friends. Just like when the players on the pitch playing for the national side. Great, great goal. For you to always be mindful of your uh, groin area when you're in such a Forming a wall against this uh, crazy ball coming from coming your way. Having fun and having a good laugh. A uh, football game. No need to get so serious about it. Just the game. John Terry. Or is he John Terry? Or why is he wearing an Argentinian national team uniform? Take that, FIFA. Of course, the rival franchise, the 500 pound gorilla in the world, is none other than the eSports FIFA um, soccer series. Winning 11 9. Winning 11 9, yeah. Of course, um, the Japanese uh, games really love to you know, say the title of the game when it starts. And I think Winning Eleven comes from way back when, when there was 16-bit uh, consoles and more, I guess, up-to-date kind of title or alternative title for the North American uh, demographic is uh, Pro Evolution Soccer. I believe this is Pro Evolution Soccer 5, released in 2005. Konami makes no bones about this being a port game, makes no apologies. As you uh, can see here, this is uh, basically a PS2 controller layout that I need to conform my Xbox 360 controller to. And aside from these two trigger buttons, where on PS2 apparently they are under just a set of normal buttons, normal shorter buttons, um, you know, it translates pretty well. Uh, I just have to be mindful of this uh, different, I guess, instead of letters, the you use symbols, so... And uh, yeah, pretty uh, catchy tune. The language... I also changed the commentary language where I was installing the game. There's an option for you to basically install a Spanish version of the commentary. I wonder how that sound like. Also the in-game text. Alright, so yeah, as you can see... Uh, French, German, Italian, and of course Spanish. And here you can uh, see a different, uh, I guess, gallery of uh, trophies for each league, licensed or not. Okay, anyways. And WE Shop. This is, um, well, there's actually a point system in this game as you play the game and complete training courses, and there are a lot of training courses. You can get something called WEN. Uh, I guess winning 11 notes or something and you can um, use those WENs to unlock players and teams and background music probably access uh, through the menu and uh, play it to your liking let's see if I can unlock some player here because I even have a point okay I'm going to, do I see any name that I recognize no, I don't have any, um, any soccer knowledge. Well, I don't know. Maybe these are the legends that I can unlock and use. Let's just select a cool name then. I don't know. Um, who knows Summit? Sure, why not? I unlocked uh, Mr. Hugo Summit. 
Alright, I don't know what that does, but alright. Anyways, uh, let's go and uh, try to play a game, huh? Uh, we have a match, which is just an exhibition uh, match, which I'm going to play. Master League is, um, I guess, basically your franchise mode, where you can take the club team and uh, bring it to all the way to championship, uh, and the glory is beyond. And League is uh, either any of the licensed leagues that you can uh, join, and also uh, fictional leagues, they're available. Cup is more of a equivalent to World Cup, a really exciting uh, tournament. Uh, pitting one nationality against each other, and some of them are licensed. If you check the league, uh, I'll probably go to the match and show you the, how the league is uh, represented. You can see that the leagues are represented by these five global regions. Um, well, maybe not, you can also select a league directly here. English League, I guess it's called Premier League. I guess they have to, they couldn't license the entire Premier League. Uh, that's or FIFA uh, with their uh, great uh, resources and money they can just probably outright uh, strike a deal with all the teams that they want. Of course Chelsea uh, is licensed and Arsenal. Uh, of course uh, Arsenal and Chelsea are I think are they London based? Man Red I guess you can sort of uh, guess what that basically equivalent uh, to a Premier League of course, it's Manchester United, right? Uh, all right. I'm not really well versed in uh, for soccer, the game of soccer. I'm more of a, I guess, basketball and baseball guy. Uh, North American sports. Uh, I apologize. Uh, <laughs> but then, um, you know, I recognize Chelsea and Arsenal and Man, Man U. I mean, they're the global, globally uh, well recognized teams. Going to French league. Uh, I have no idea which team is uh, licensed and which team is not. Yeah, no, no idea. German League? Well, um, I don't think any of this team is licensed, although I'm... Uh, I do recognize Leverkusen and Dortmund and yeah, those kind of Munich. Um, Serie A? Oh, there's actually a couple of licensed teams. Um, I think Inter Milan, right? And Lazio, uh, with its uh, famous fans. Um, I don't know, is this a Dutch league? Sounds, yeah. Looks like it's Dutch league. Yeah, PSV Eindhoven, of course. Uh, this is definitely Spanish league with Real Madrid, which is uh, licensed. And FC Barcelona, very nice. Other league, Galatasaray, I think it's Turkish league. This is some, um, I don't know, Galaxy league or something, or Major League Soccer. Alright, so we've come to the national uh, teams here. I'm going to uh, play uh, Battle of the Nations once again. And uh, the nations I'm going to pick are based on um, purely analytics on my channel. Definitely Germany, Canada, and United States up there, top three. But Germany I have already played in uh, VR Soccer 96. So I'm going to uh, skip Germany uh, for this time. I'm going to return to your uh, country um, uh, you know, in no time. The fourth. It's surprisingly Poland. So I'm going to pick Poland. And for the opponent, I'm going to pick Poland because it's going to be an underdog. Um, I mean, no disrespect. It's going to be England because the um, United Kingdom was uh, fifth in number of views. And while there is um, Scotland and Wales, I can pick. But I think England is more representative of the United Kingdom team, right? So I pick England and this is going to be a pretty hard match. So if I lose like 3 nothing, please uh, don't get mad at me. Um, and so I lowered the difficulty to 2 stars, which is uh, one less than the default difficulty. Uh, I'm going to hack the time still. Uh, okay, so I, I'm okay with all the other options. Alright, so let's go to formation settings. And I'm going to probably have to change the formation, although I'm not really, again, I'm not very well-versed in soccer, but I do appreciate the, uh, the, the depth and the breadth of the strategic layer that is evident in organizing uh, your you know, soccer matches and in terms of formations and roles and yeah, sorting your players like, to your um, advantages and try to always look for the mismatches. Okay, so let's see if I can edit positions. No, I'm not really... Yeah, this is what I wanted. 
So probably want some defense heavy defense heavy formation. Um, okay. Um, sh well, should I gamble and try to use this particular formation? Kind of looks like a smiley face uh, turned 90 degrees. All right, so I'm going to uh, use this. Let's see if I can, um, I don't know, score some goals. Poland and England exhibition. Nice stadium. Wow, look at the English fans and Polish fans. David Beckham, number seven. Good evening and welcome to tonight's I game. I surprised him myself. Trevor Brooking to give us his thoughts. Trevor. Thanks, Peter. Both teams have a reputation, I think, going for goal and attacking play. Let's hope it is a good game. Come on, then. I will sort of uh, pipe down and let the commentators take over. The commentating this game seems pretty decent. I defer to them for the on-action commentary. Okay, Alright, so the game starts. Rooney is uh, being a pest here. From left to right, you can see because he's, uh, he has a balding head. Lovely control here. Lovely control. Jim Koviak. I find that in this type of soccer game, you just have to have a constant motion back and forth. Raziak. Short a pass. Chance here. Nope. It's out of play, and that's a goal kick. Just a nonsensical pass. Nonsensical lob. Was dangerous play. Dangerous. Free, quite rightly, has given a free kick. Come on. That pass didn't make it. They push it forward nicely here. The rush, but you lose the control of your ball. A good delivery, and we may well see the first goal here. Oh, uh, he overshot the ball. It will be a throw. Okay, well, good attempt, though. Spirited offense. Booted to safety. Kersnovek. Oh my goodness. I was trying to be cute there and lost the ball. Well, the through ball was not good enough. Danger's gone. You know, of course, there's uh, two particular. Oh my goodness. Well, he may have lost concentration. That was off target. I think he knew what he was doing, but just couldn't pull it off. Fifteen minutes gone in the first half. The danger is snuffed out. Zurafsky going for goal. Oh, close. The three has blown the whistle. It was uh, going directly to the goalkeeper, although it was uh, had a, uh, I guess, power. Okay, this guy is going back. Carry. Oh, nice, nice, nice. A good cross should set something up. Ah, uh, that was very disappointing. Owen. You can see how the defense collapsed around me. The, the AI is doing a really good job playing the defense. And trying to get the ball here, trying to uh, control the ball really well here. They've got a corner there. You're dangerous. English uh, side has a lot of it's into the face of goal. great leapers. Okay, so I was able to barely get the ball out. It's a crucial. Uh oh. I have a shot. He's gone for goal. Another corner. Oh wow, that was on target. Okay, David Beckham. Bend it like Beckham. Don't bend it into the goal. Bend it to this guy, number five. To the target in the middle. Oh they my goodness. Go. Oh. oh it's in. What a goal. Yeah. There's the opener. Overmatched. Overmatched. 25 minutes played. Who's this guy? A beautiful right foot finish. Beautiful right foot finish. 
Yeah, I agree. Well, that goal has disappointed a very large number of fans here today. Oh, man. Goalie made a spectacular save, though, but the defense, I think, I guess, Tom May was not able to get there to the really ball. There really was no stopping that. Okay, so one nothing. They've just got a goal down, Trevor. They're not going to be too happy about that, are they? No, I'm sure they'll be determined to get back level as soon as possible. All right, it was disappointing given uh, I had some couple of good chances. I mean, I don't know. Three game possession. Oh, oh, this is promising. And he's gone for goal. Oh, there was opportunity, close. not on target there. Well, you know, Peter, the defender should have been much closer on him. Sloppy defended really to give him so much space. And if I, um, yeah, so much space, so almost 30 minutes gone. I was aiming a bit toward the inner side of the goal, maybe I'll have a better chance. No back. Uh, this guy is tall and large. Rooney. Rooney. Okay, bit, uh, late there, I'm sliding. There's no quarter being given or asked. Mm -hmm. That one is intercepted. Gerard. Okay. Joe Cole. Oh. Upper game. They can swing it in from the left wing. Get the ball. Oh. <laughs> Just over a shot. Run over his head. Another opportunity uh -oh. for a cross. This looks like a promising nope. cross. Nope. Through Chips. your body. Great. My defensive formation. I guess uh, had a part in... Uh, Missing as many bodies. He cut that one out very well. In front of the English players. No way through. Owen. No, he doesn't pick out his man. Okay. Both teams All are right. stuck in. Uh, okay. He's done very well to support the attack. Ah. Uh, well, he really got hold of that one, Peter. He came out and set it right over the touchline. One step late. Oh, man. It's clear. Five minutes uh, to the end of the first half. Uh, okay. The referee sounds his whistle. Come on. Okay, let's get the ball out. Get the ball out. Ashley Cole. Uh, give me some break. Ashley Cole. Beckham. We know he can deliver it well. No, it's a stay away from, in. stay away from the goal. Gary Neville. Hefty challenge. Great there. challenge. They can swing it in from the right wing. Nice. Come on, don't stop the, the time. Wing. Don't stop the time. He's looking for Close. support. Ah, uh, come and that's on, it for the first half. You bastard. Give us your feelings on that half, Trevor. Well, they're doing a lot of things right particularly their use of the width and moving into space, but need to brush up on their finishing skills. Yes, they were talking about the Polish the team. goal divides the two teams at the moment then, as we eagerly wait That the was the first goal, one, wasn't it? Nope, there wasn't, but it was pretty close. The flashes, wow. Yeah, a couple of good chances for the Polish side as well. Great. This was what, yeah, Beckham delivering a great corner kick. Very low and very low and uh, accurate. All right, okay. That was pretty good, actually. I kind of impressed myself. I'm uh, trying to turn the ball outside of the defense. That was uh, so close, so close. Okay, let's begin the second half. The players have had their half-time break, and the second period gets underway. Now attacking the goal to our left, are Poland, and to our right are England. Ah, Rooney, you are just so... A decent ball in! No. Nope. Decent, but not good enough. Get the ball out. Now the defender read it well. They are going at it, hammer and tongs. Zuravsky. Oh, that's a, that's a foul. That's a foul. Give him red card. Um, I guess, right. That one is intercepted. Rooney. Okay, Rooney, get the ball. Great, Possession, give it great away. siding tackle. Okay, well, they're really passing to my number one guy. 
Oh, so what you're, you're paid with all of. This could be the chance to equalize. Yep. Oh, no. Got pushed away by the defense. They can cross it in yet again. Let's uh, keep his ball there. Okay, well. I tried. I tried. Ah. No, no don't give me a red card, please. It was just a. Just a warning, right? Just a warning. Oh, come on. It's a booking. Booking, huh? That is the At least it was a, of the game. Just the yellow. Okay, was it was a. Totally a unnecessary yeah, it was quite pretty bad. It was Rooney, though, right? Joe Cole. <laughs> I'm just kidding, man. I'm just uh, joking around. Put the Polish side at least score a goal. Well. Knocks it back to the keeper. Well, these kind of uh, soccer games. Gerard. It's so hard to score a goal. What is Jeller doing? Owen. Trying to lay an egg or something. Joe Cole. And he oh, a long get pass. the ball out! Get the ball out! The shot comes in. Good defense. Well, it came off Polish the defender corner. there. And Beckham is going to take it, right? Yeah. Drives Beckham. it to the middle. Oh my goodness. Man, that has to be some. Oh my god, direct to the goalie. That was basically going in. A good ball into Come on, the near get out, post. Get out. Get out. That was a foul. The tight defense has managed to contain. Nice pass. Breakaway. Going all the way. Ah oh, man! The, could see that was the pass to the, the right. guy just waiting to the left of this guy. Opportunity to bring the game level there, Trevor. Yes, to be choked about that. Owen. That was just pure uh, example of will there. The referee has blown his whistle. Come on, that was just a flop. Look how big the guy was. Anyways. Okay, just a second. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. By me, I'm on your side. Clearly a foul. Back him, huh? Bit of, bit of, bit of a frustrating challenge. Being frustrated there, Beckham. Ah, oh, can never make this work. Balls out for a goal kick. Oh, get the ball. Back. Back at the yellow card. Hence the yellow number. This guy's uh, Polish Beckham, number seven. From Polish Beckham, I know you can do it. Oh. What? Oh my goal. goodness, what a brutal pass. The marking's been tight and so far it's working. Okay, I don't want to get a second red card, but... The whistle choice. is gone. Oh. This is another red card. Okay. This will be a real test for the defense. And the Jump up. Get the ball. It's a big opportunity with okay. a corner. Jared is hurt. Oh my goodness, why? Just trying to waste time. Drives it to the near post. Nice. Just have to shoot the ball away. <laughs> and see what happens. It's an early cross. No way. Get the weak souls cross out of here. We're into the final quarter of an hour. Quarter of an hour. Let's say 15 minutes. Okay. Jim Koviak. Oh. They got the ball again. Rooney. Oh, okay. So they, uh, I can hear people chanting Rooney's name or going Roo or something. Oh, excuse me. Oh, come on. Beckham. Lampard. Good defending. Right back to Beckham though. Come on, Polish back. Beckham versus Beckham. No. Wow, look at and Beckham's ball control. Ball back. Beckham. <laughs> Polish players are falling all over the place. I can get the ball from this guy trying Lampard. to waste time. The foul was committed. We're frustrated here. Yellow card. Yes, here's a card. Yellow card. That's tall. That's his side's second booking today. 
Mbappe, Yenes and Dennis. They're going to try to hold on to the lead by making this change, Trevor. Yes, I think they're probably looking for a fresh pair of legs to carry them through. Oh yeah, it's I'm a gonna... good try. That was... I'm gonna change my own player. Okay, let me bring my player here. Best player ever. Do that. Oh, that's a goalkeeper. Um, guy seems a bit down. But Radomski. Yes. What did I did I do that? No. I'm not so sure what I'm doing here. Oh uh, boy. I don't know. Okay. All right. Well, anyways, uh. Let's right, see if I can score a goal here, go to overtime, or what's it called, extra time in soccer comments. Okay. Chance to cross, and he crosses. Yes. No. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Let me pick the ball back here. One more chance, right? Yeah, another Rizzo. cross. That's the answer. That is that he is hundred percent foul. Just bomb rushed me. It just bomb rushed me. I should call you bomb rusher. This has been a hard fought game. The ball has crossed the line. Hard fought game. Yep, that's for sure. Oh, okay. Here are the substitutions. Yeah, go Adamski. You be our hero, right? Be the hero. Oh man. Doesn't <laughs> work between that time. Going for goal. Going for goal. That's it. That's the final whistle. Ah, uh, okay. Loss, but a loss nonetheless. Very hard loss for the Polish side, but they fought valiantly. They never really looked like coming back into it, did they, after they considered that early goal, Trevor? No, they didn't, and they'd be disappointed with that. They had plenty of time to make the breakthrough, and they just didn't take advantage of it. Mm -hmm, that's true. They have a couple of chances. That's all we have time for this evening, so thanks to Trevor Brooking. Thank you, Peter. It was a great game of football, and we look forward to seeing you at the next game. Good night. Thank you, Trevor and Peter. Uh, your commentating definitely really made this LP a bit bearable to those who actually know uh, about soccer or football. And uh, yeah, that was the goal. Yeah, very, very unfortunate. They all started with a great cross by Beckham. Uh, J. Cole was able to just put it back in. So easy. This is one of the chances I got, but yeah. Beckham provided um, great crosses, epic crosses. In terms of. Um, I guess rating the player. I don't know whether this uh, game is. Uh, this, this game doesn't really have. Does it have a rating of players after uh, playing the game? Yeah, here we go. So Dudek did pretty well. He did all he could. Um, all this, yeah, didn't really do well, especially in the defense. Back and Raza. Anyways, uh, Joe Cole definitely was the man of the match. I'll probably give it to Beckham though, because Beckham was the, I guess, facilitator. Right. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this uh, other LP of uh, Sports Game. This time it's a win winning 11 9. Pro Evolution Soccer 5. A great game. Much better than VR Soccer 96. Of course, there has been the period of nine years uh, between those games but I really like this game I might have to keep it on the hard drive and see if I can um, improve my skills on it and then maybe it's going to uh, translate well to um, you know newer game or newer entries in the series if I decide to actually you know, revisit uh, soccer in a more modern setting with more licensed teams and whatnot and uh, okay anyways I've been talking too long uh, thank you for your uh, viewership and um, until next sports game Stay tuned.